All right, dear YouTubers, it's time for another installment of my Watch That Scooter Age very thrilling series. We are now looking at 55,545 and I'm right now in the beautiful Ottawa Valley. Um, I live in Ottawa and uh, just tootling around and just wanted to share with everybody what this looks like. And um, I'll see you back in roughly 10 kilometers. All right, everyone, we are now getting very close, and I was thinking that we'll do the last two kilometers together. I'm now approaching what is called the Marlboro Forest within the beautiful Ottawa Valley in Canada, and it is a very, very rich soil here lots of vegetation and also trucks as you will see and here we'll go Five. Now we'll have a little walkabout around the scooter to see how it is ages and what is new. I'll see you right back. So nothing has changed much about the scooter. I only have two small additions, but very helpful ones. Number one is extended weights on the handlebars to the left and to the right. They weigh about 10 kilos, extend the leverage as well as the weight of the handlebar and provide much greater stability. Also, the windshield never held properly when there was big wind pressure and so I've installed handmade a second bracket that goes on the outside of the original and it's now very very solid, uh, the windshield itself. It no longer bends um, in any direction, even in strong winds. One problem I can see coming up in the future is that with my homemade rain skirt, it scuffs on the top of the paint and I will have to deal with that sooner or later before it scuffs off all the lacquer. 
Otherwise, the scooter is is in mint condition as it always has been. So far, there is no major problems. The only real nuisance I had is that these studs on the exhaust manifold, where it goes right into the cylinder, they were seven millimeter bolts and they kept breaking and it was very labor intensive to fix that. And it happened three times and I put in eight millimeter bolts and have no more problems since. And the scooter is as picture perfect and also in its performance um, just like day one. It is absolutely beautiful. And the engine sounds as mature and quiet as it always has. All right, this was my third installment at 55,555.5 kilometers. Goodbye.